How do you distinguish between intuition and ego? The answer is by falling on your face again and again through error. Okay. I mean, a part of why you, you all like me and I like you is that we can allow our humanity. And our humanity is that I will listen to my intuition and then I hear something and it says, this is God speaking to you. Take off all your clothes, you know. So sometimes I do, and then it's inappropriate at that moment, and later I have to say, say, hey, everybody, I'm kind of sorry I took off all my clothes, and it's the whole thing, you know. But I was listening to that voice inside of me. But it is perfectly all right. If you already knew, the, you, if you already could hear what the Quakers call the still small voice within, perfectly, you wouldn't have taken incarnation in the first place, unless you just dropped by to bless us. But to the extent that you have any work to do, you are bound to hear the wrong voice and fall on your face. And the only thing that changes is the, is the lag time between the time you fall on your face and the time you'll cop to it. Okay, and that's called truth, not consistency. Okay?